G'day guys, Viv here again from Battle Bunker down in Melbourne. As you know, I'm on my Her Starts trip at the moment. Casting, all that sort of stuff. Mould, plaster, lovely sort of stuff. So uh, I jumped onto YouTube and I was looking around for Her Starts, stuff that people might be doing with Her Starts, etc. Just so I can get a feel for what's out there already. And um, I came across a guy called oh, Clean Beal 4. I'll show his uh, YouTube account in a minute and put the description uh, his link out uh, here. When I was casting with Hearthstarts a few years back, I got into SketchUp a little bit. SketchUp is a Google application, a 3D CAD program. It's free, or was free, uh, back then. Um, and I was using it at that stage for putting together templates or designs for Hearthstarts builds. And um, if you jump onto their website, www.hearthstarts.com, and go have a look around in the community, you'll be able to find a lot of people doing some really cool stuff with uh, SketchUp. SketchUp allows you to create CAD files, share them with people, etc. You can then install those on your installation on your PC and work with the components that SketchUp allows you to build stuff from. So a lot of the people from the Hearst community had built SketchUp data files of all the different blocks. Now I don't know where they're up to so far, but a couple of years back they were fair way through the range uh, creating all of the uh, blocks that come from all of the moulds. You simply download the mould number that would give you the components in that mold and then you could use SketchUp to start piecing everything together. So I came across this guy's website. Let's go have a look and, uh, and see what he's got up there because there's some fantastic stuff. If you're into computers and you're into CAD design and you're into Hearst, then SketchUp is a great tool to be able to give you a, a readout or a, or a visual feel for what you're going to build before you start casting stuff. Let's check out his website. Okay cool, let's jump into his YouTube page and have a quick look. Ta-da! So here we are. This is his uh, YouTube account here, Kling, Klingvile4. <coughs> Excuse me. And you can see he's got uh, 12 videos uploaded. T 10 of these videos here are related to uh, SketchUp. And the first one on his homepage that he's featured there is uh, Teacher SketchUp, uh, the basic tool. So let's go check that out. Hurry up. I'm going to show you how to build a simple sci-fi modular dungeon using SketchUp, but first we're going to cover the basic tools. When you open up SketchUp, it'll start you off with a pencil tool. This is used to draw lines and create basic Okay, so in this video he goes through just the basics, obviously. Let's jump out, out of this one. Go have a look at something, uh, something else here. So bricks in the wall, a modular dungeon. So far we have our basic floor template. What we're going to do now is create a basic wall template. We're going to grab this generic wall piece here, control to duplicate, we're going to move it over here to work with it. And then we're going to grab one of these pipe pieces to create a bookend sort of look. I'm going to rotate that up on its end. Like so, and then move it on over. So SketchUp is awesome for being able to work with these blocks here and as you can see um, it's very easy to use. All of these blocks, these data files you can download and install into your installation of SketchUp and then just as he's showing here and uh, um, I haven't used it for a long time, just move the blocks around be able to create uh, the, the build that you need to and have a real good understanding of what you're going to have to cast, what's going to be involved in building that uh, project before you actually start casting any plaster. So let's jump out of that uh, video come back to his YouTube account so once again there we go the URL at the top of the screen there I'll also throw it up in the description as well let's close up out of that page so that's a real quick look at his website pretty interesting huh you can check out um, Google SketchUp at uh, should have done some research research I'm pretty sure it's www.sketchup.com uh, I'm sure if you do a Google search, it'll come up the first thing in the list. Anyway, I'll find that information out. Chuck it here in the description. Um, yeah, sweet stuff. All right, guys, I'll catch you next time. Have a good night. See ya.